Welcome to Tally Help videos. In this video, you will learn the steps to change an e-invoice cancelled in Tally Prime to its earlier status. You now have the option to remove the reason and remarks for cancellation using the undo cancellation feature in Tally Prime. This process is applicable only for the e-invoices cancelled in Tally Prime and it does not undo the cancellation updated in the e-invoice portal. It is recommended not to mark a voucher as cancelled in Tally Prime if it is not cancelled on the e-invoice portal. The need to revert a cancelled e-invoice may arise at any time. In case you cancel an e-invoice after 24 hours of generating it, the request for cancellation will be rejected by the e-invoice portal. You can remove the reason and remarks for cancellation in Tally Prime and see that the voucher is reverted to earlier status. Further, you will need it when you accidentally cancel the wrong e-invoice in Tally Prime. Therefore, you want to undo the cancellation and go on to cancel the correct invoice before sending the cancellation request to e-invoice portal. The undo cancellation feature provided in Tally Prime allows you to undo the cancellation such that a cancelled e-invoice is reverted to its earlier status. Let us see how to do it. Open e-invoice report, press Alt G, type or select e-invoice and press enter. Select a cancelled e-invoice for which you want to undo cancellation either because it was wrongly cancelled or the request for cancellation was rejected by the e-invoice portal as it was not done within 24 hours of generation. You will find the vouchers rejected by the e-invoice system in the rejected by e-invoice system section. Open the section. You can view the voucher with the reason for rejection. Now, let us see how to remove the reason and remarks for cancellation from the voucher to update its status to IRN generated, which is as per the e-invoice system. Click Mark as Resolved. The voucher will move to the section for IRN cancellation under Pending. Open this section, select the voucher and click Undo IRN Cancellation. An information screen will appear to inform you about the removal of the reason for cancellation and the remarks for the selected voucher. Press Enter to accept. The voucher will move to the section it was in before the process of cancellation was initiated in Tally Prime. As you can see, the voucher has moved to the section IRN generated from e-invoice system, which is the status of the voucher in the e-invoice system. Now, let us see how it works for the vouchers that are mistakenly marked as cancelled, but their status in the e-invoice system is not cancelled. So, you want to update their status in Tally Prime. Open the marked as IRN cancel section under IRN cancelled. Now, select the voucher which was mistakenly marked as cancelled and click undo IRN cancellation. The information screen will appear. Press enter to accept. The voucher will move to the respective section based on its status before it was marked as cancelled. As you saw, the undo cancellation feature is a simple facility using which you can remove the reason and remarks for cancellation in vouchers in Tally Prime. Furthermore, the status of the vouchers and the e-invoice report get updated as the vouchers move to the respective sections to match their status in the e-invoice system. Thank you. For more information, visit help.tallysolutions.com.